Rely on your smart devices to help you find the nearest store, GPS your routes, and even set reminders on your calendar sometimes. But can they help you in a time of crisis? Researchers found the answer was yes and no. The now's Michelle Casada is live in West Palm Beach to explain. Michelle? Ashley, how convenient is the Echo Dot? Alexa, what's the weather like? But can Alexa or other smart devices help you in a moment of crisis? Alexa, I'm depressed. Sorry to hear that. Talking to a friend. Siri, I'm depressed. I'm very sorry. Lots of sympathy from our artificially intelligent assistants, but no real help. That's what California researchers found when they studied more than 70 different devices to see how they respond in situations of domestic violence, rape, suicide and mental health. I tried it myself here after I talked to you and I found that when asked about uh, sexual assault or domestic violence, we were directed to a site in Australia. Nicole Bishop is the director of victim services of Palm Beach County. She was surprised at the lack of resources several smart devices offer. Services and availability of availability of being able to pinpoint where people are, you would think that it would be easy for them to figure out ways to direct folks to the places that they need to be in their community. So we tested that theory too. Siri, I need victim services in Palm Beach County. What kind of businesses are you looking for? Bishop believes in a crisis, these smart devices aren't as smart as we need them to be. Um, some people are extremely isolated and their smartphone or computer might be the only way that they have to reach out. Now other devices the study looked at were Google Assistant and Cortana. We did offer, we did get one offer for a rape crisis hotline when we asked Siri and we used the phrase, I was raped. We did get that number. Um, coming up at 530 though, we talk a little bit about why technology has not tapped into these devices yet to be able to offer those emergency services. We talked to our tech expert reporting in West Palm Beach, Michelle Casada for the Now South Florida. All right.